highest common factor. Highest common factor has another name the greatest common divisor also. Suppose you have the two numbers 26 and so many other numbers. So, what will be the highest common factor? The common factor that is highest to both the numbers right 8 has the factors 1, 2, 4 and 8, 12 has the factors 1, 2, 3, 4 and 6. The highest common factor out of them the common factors are 1, 2 and 4 but greatest is 4. So, 4 is the HCF or we call it GCD of the 8 and 12. We write multiples of 3 and we write multiples of 4. Here 12 and 24 are common to both but out of them 12 is the smallest one or we can call the lowest common factor to both 3 and 12. That is why 12 is known as the lowest common factor for 3 and 12. So, 12 is the LCM of the two numbers. Next is prime factorization. 18 can be written as the 6 and 3 so on we can factorize it. So, it is the finding the prime numbers you need to multiply together to get the original number. For 18 we had 2 into 3 into 3. What is a factor 3? When you write the factors for 18 it would be 6 and 3, factors for 6 would be 2 and 3 and for factors for 3 would be 3 itself. So, the factors for 18 are 2 into 3 into 3. Now we can learn the prime factorization method to find the HCF. For that we are taking one example here. The example is finding the HCF of 48 and 12. Now 48 and 52 can be written as the product of prime factors. 48 can be written as 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 whereas 52 can be written as 2 into 2 into 13. The factors common to both are 2 into 2. So, we write the HCF would be 2 into 2 which is common to both right that is 4. Next example finding the GCD of 24, 36 and 84. Now, we will do the same thing but with the 3 numbers this time that is 24 first factors for 24 would be 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 factors for 36 now we are going to write that would be 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 factors for 84 would be 2 into 2 into 3 into 7. Now, if you take out the common factors highest common factors to both that is 2 into 2 into 3 that makes 4 into 3 that is 12. So, HCA for all the 3 numbers would 12. Now, finding the LCM with the division method. This is a one very interesting method to learn. Finding the LCM of 12, 15 and 20 with the division method. The step number 1 would be you divide the numbers with the smallest number which divide at least 2 numbers and bring down the numbers which are not divisible like here. Now, step number 2 is continuing to divide the smallest prime number till the least common factor you get is 1. So, you can get it like this. Now, step number 3 is multiplying all the common factors together that is 2 into 2 into 3 into 5. So, the LCM for 12, 15 and 20 is 60.